All right, so the first thing we have is gonna be Make sure to check out my channel for more videos just like this. All right, folks, so here we are at Paul Dean's Family Kitchen. So about to check it out. Hopefully some really good food. Peace out. All right, people, so before we get started with the review, I just want to let you all know that this is located within the island at Pigeon Forest, Tennessee. Um, the one reason why I want to mention this is there's this really cool little water show that has like water and lights and music. So make sure if you do stop by this place um, to make sure to check it out either before or after your dinner. It's really nice to see. Alright, on to the actual restaurant itself. So I mean it's just pretty much like any rent restaurant that's like near a theme park or themed or whatever you want to call it. A huge gift shop with a bunch of Paula Deen's um, like materials and things and stuff like that. I never really watched her show before, but this is just kind of catered towards her show in her kitchen. And then as far as the actual dining restaurant itself, it's on the second floor, so you do have to take an escalator up the stairs and just kind of go ahead and be seated or whatever. All right. Elevator when you first check in. Now, as far as the food and the menu, so pretty much the way this works is it's considered family style, which is like basically buffet, but they bring the food out to you nice and hot and fresh. Um, what I did was I did go solo. I just want to come here to do a review, but I got the three meats and then the, I think three sides and stuff like that. Um, but I'll just tell you right now, this place was good as well. Oh my goodness. It was just so freshly tasting good. It's just, ugh. Um, let's first start with the biscuits. So the cheese biscuits, um, at first, I thought they were going to be like Red Lobster, but they're not. They're really nice and just ugh, just so moist and so good. So definitely make sure you start with those biscuits. I believe they're included, if I'm not mistaken. And then as far as the food, so I had never been to a family restaurant before this, since I didn't know you're supposed to take, basically take it from your plate and add it on. So I was just eating at the bowls looking like a crazy person. But either way, the food was really, really good. So... Like I said, I'm just going to cut straight to the chase. Um, this def this restaurant and the rating is definitely a must do. Um, I haven't been here for breakfast. I just went here for dinner. But as far as the price and all that stuff, I believe it's about $25, 26 a person. So keep that in mind. But the food is really good. The food came out nice and fast. It took maybe about 5, 10 minutes at the most for everything to come out. And then also includes a nice little dessert as well. Um, I got like a little brownie cake that I end up just taking with me. But... So the food is really good. So if you're looking for a really good place to come to in Pigeon Forge, definitely go here. Even the wait time. I mean, when I went here, it was pretty busy, but the wait time was about maybe 25 minutes. So it wasn't too bad. And this was on a weekend day. So just kind of keep that in mind. Um, but yeah, like I said, the Paula Deen's Kitchen, definitely you want to go here. Load up. Um, I ended up getting the fried chicken, the fried catfish, and the ribs. And they were all just really, really good. So for dinner time, you really can't go wrong. So again, like I said, it's a good... Good restaurant, definitely check it out. So I hope you all enjoyed this quick review. Like I said, I'm gonna start doing a lot more of these because I go to a lot of different restaurants, even though I'm trying to lose weight. Um, I do like to do a lot of different restaurants. So I'm like, instead of just going there eating and just thinking to myself, it's great, I might as well go ahead and do some quick reviews. So if you all enjoyed this, make sure to check out some other restaurants I did. I'm planning to do one major restaurant at East Disney Park, Universal, Volcano Bay, Pigeon Forge, Gatlinburg. I'm gonna be all over the place. So I mean, definitely check out my channel. I think I'm gonna go ahead and put a playlist together. So definitely check out the playlist when it pops up on the little box up here. But again, I thank you all for your support. I'll see you next time. It's your boy, Mr. Bucket List. Peace out.